I think I think it was a, a world of pure imagination in that you had to uh, imagine that it wasn't a uh, half abandoned warehouse in Glasgow. Oompa Loompa Doompity Dooped? A Willy Wonka festival in Glasgow, Scotland has been dubbed on social media as the fire festival for kids after families were left massively disappointed by the event. The Willy's Chocolate Experience event was organized by London-based House of Illuminati and it promised fans that they could quote, indulge in a chocolate fantasy like never before and said on the website that event goers would quote, embark on a journey filled with wondrous creations and enchanting surprises at every turn. Unfortunately, it appears that attendees did not get the golden ticket. Access Hollywood spoke with actor Paul Connell, who claims he was hired at the event to play Willy Wonka, and he described what he saw, saying he was told to give kids a couple of jelly beans and had to read what he described as an AI-generated script. It was an absolute disaster from the start of the day to the end of the day, really. It, it's The day started and no, it was... Nothing was remotely magical. Or, I mean, we didn't even, there wasn't even chocolate. Like, you would, a chocolate factory would have, would be chocolate. But we were, we were told to hand out uh, a couple of jelly beans and a quarter of a cup of lemonade to, to the children. So they, they didn't even get chocolate. So I would say that the script was a disaster because it was clearly AI generated. So it was just, it was just gibberish. One day to learn 15 pages of gibberish. Um, it was, yeah, and by the end of the day, it, it, it the police were called. Um, you know, people were shouting. They, they were, you know, people were fearing for their, for their safety by the end of the day. Images from the event appear to show a sparsely decorated warehouse, which varies greatly from the images shown on the event's ticketing website. House of Illuminati reportedly issued a statement saying they would be giving full refunds to customers and apologized for the quote, stressful and frustrating day, per The Guardian. The outlet also reported that police were called to the venue after complaints had been made, and Paul explained what happened from his point of view. Yeah, so the event lasted um, until I would say about 1, 2 p.m., something like that. It was supposed to last until about 8 p.m. at the night. So the, 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 the funny thing is, is I'd been playing Wonka at this point. I was supposed to get regular breaks, but I, I had a break I, and I'd been playing Willy Wonka for about three and a half hours uh, to the point where I didn't know where I ended and Wonka. And we, I was now like a Heath Ledger level <laughs> like method acting Willy Wonka by this point. So a few of the others um, came and was like, you need to go on a break, like go on a break recover for a minute so I, i'd gone outside um and just stared uh, into into space for a bit and just thought about how you know bad my life choices are at this moment and then when i came back after lunch was when it had, it had gone a bit crazy so uh, they, they'd closed down the event as a, a a mob of of angry uh, rightfully angry I'll, I'll i'll add parents and and children crying parents upset um, there was shouting, there was um, people being threatened. Um, I made my way back into the into the venue um, and it had just descended to a point where people were running everywhere. People were building things on their phone. They were putting their phone in people's faces. Um, uh, kids, there was a little girl dressed as an umpa lumpa crying, which is the saddest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I know. <laughs> so... Um, it was it was absolutely crazy. So um, I turned to the other actors and said, "How will we go to the pub?" So we we kind of uh, just went to the pub for a little while, and then when we came back from the pub, uh, that's when the police had arrived. There was two police vans and two squad cars, uh, and there was police just trying to calm people down. I think uh, there was people were were rightfully worried to become an event where it, it becomes violent. 